What's up guys, Xbox Mod 360 here, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to get an invisible torso and invisible arms in Grand Theft Auto 5 online. So I want to start off by saying this glitch was filmed on Xbox One, so I do know this works on next gen consoles, I'm not sure about old gen. And this method will allow you to save it to your outfit so that you'll have this little invisibility whenever you want to use it. So to do this little glitch, you're just going to go to any clothing store and you're just going to purchase a couple different tops. So you're just going to go to the top section in the clothing store and you're going to go over to suit jackets. And then you're going to go down to blue scruffy jacket. And once you've bought that, you're going to go down to pink sports coat and you're going to buy that one as well. So once you've bought those two jackets, another thing you're going to have to buy is one of those new heist utility vests. I'm pretty sure it works with more than one of these, so if you already have one purchased, you could try it out. But the one I used is the black heavy utility vest, and that one always works for me. And after you have your utility vest, there's just one more thing you're going to buy. You're going to go over to shirts, and you're just going to buy yourself a red checkered untucked shirt. This one right here. So once you've bought all four of those things, you're just going to make your way over to your apartment. You do have to have an apartment that has a little clothes closet, but I'm pretty sure just about every property you can buy has one of these. So once you're in here, you're going to go to alter your clothes, and you're going to go to your suit jackets, and you're going to put on that blue scruffy jacket you just bought. Then you're going to go ahead and put on that red checkered shirt. Then back over to the suit jackets, and you're going to scroll down to that pink sports coat you bought, and you're just going to hover over it, but not click it. Then you're going to hit start and you're going to go over to swap character. So you're going to do that without clicking on it, you're just going to be hovering over the pink sports jacket and if you're doing this all right, your arm should be invisible when you do that. So once you get to this screen right here, you're just going to select that character that you were just using and your arm should be invisible on this screen right here. If they're not, you most likely did something wrong, but you could try going through with it, it may end up working, it may not. But for the most part, if everything's going as planned, your arms will be invisible at this point when you select your character. And this isn't the whole glitch, you're still going to make your torso invisible as well. So you now have the invisible arms and you spawn back in the game, you should have that. And if for whatever reason you like how your character looks without the arms and still having a torso, you could always save your outfit at this point. But most people do want to get rid of the torso as well, so I'm going to show you how to do that. So when you spawn back in, it's going to kind of look like you don't have a torso, but when you turn around, you will notice that the front of your shirt is still there. So you're going to come back up into your apartment clothes closet. You're going to edit your clothing, and you're going to go down to that heist utility vest that you just bought. And you're just going to equip that on your character, and then hit no utility vest after equipping it. And that should make your entire body and arms invisible, just like this. So if everything went right and your arms and your torso are completely invisible besides that little tiny dot in the center, then you can go ahead and save your outfit so you can easily access it later on. To do this, you're just going to go back into the clothing options and you're going to hit outfits, edit saved outfits, and you're just going to save it into one of your empty slots. So once you save it, you'll be able to access it whenever you want through the interaction menu when you click outfits, and you'll pretty much have access to it permanently or at least until Rockstar takes it away from us. So I do have to give some credit to JBobGamerZ, I got part of this method from one of his videos, so I'll put a link to his channel in the description. And I would definitely suggest that all of you at least try this out and try to save it to your outfits before Rockstar goes and patches it, just in case they allow us to keep it in our outfits and you'll have it forever. So that's going to wrap up today's video. If you found this video helpful in any way, hit that like button below, and if you're new to our channel, hit that subscribe button for more amazing content just like this. And as always guys, thank you for watching from Xbox Mod 360